In this video tutorial, I'll be showing you how to make this colorful silhouette in the Game Picture Editor. First thing you want to do is choose an image that has a foreground object that strongly contrasts with the color of the background, like this goose. Choose the fuzzy selection tool. Usually at the threshold of uh, like 15, it isn't enough to uh, get rid of all of the background. So choose a higher threshold, maybe like 50, 51, yeah that's fine. And now if I select the background and uh, hit the delete key, I am left with the major features of the goose intact. And this is what I'm looking for. I'm going to go to selections. I'm going to go to invert and invert that selection. I'm going to, before I double this up, I'm going to add an alpha channel so I can have a transparency to work with when I delete it. Now with the first layer selected, go ahead and hit the delete key. And you'll notice, once I make the second layer invisible, I have a transparent silhouette in which I'm going to fill a pattern with, for the, with uh, by using the second layer. Now, with the second layer over here, I'm going to select it. And I'm going to change the selection to All and hit the Delete key. And now I have this transparent uh, transparency to work with. Uh, the first option that you have is to use the Bucket Fill tool and choose a pattern fill of, you know, just any of these patterns. For example, if I use my pattern, you'll notice that it doesn't look too bad with the silhouette, but it doesn't have an artistic flair that I'm looking for. I'm going to toss away this um, layer and show you the better uh, alternative, which is to go to filters, go to, let's see, render clouds plasma, and I'm going to change the turbulence to something like 3. That looks pretty nice in my opinion. Alright, go ahead and hit the OK button, and you'll notice that now I have this um, silhouette, which has quite an appealing color to it, color pattern. And yeah, you can see this is uh, how the um, plasma cloud looks like. Now, this is fine as it is, but we, want, we can still um, make the silhouette pop out or look engraved into the white background. In order to do this, select the first uh, silhouette layer, right click, and go to Layer Effects. Go to, let's see, one option that you have is Drop Shadow, and this will make it look as if it's, I do believe, engraved. Let me check. Yeah, see? It doesn't look too bad. The other option that you have is to right click that same uh, silhouette layer, layer effects, and go to inner shadow. Um, let's see, if you go ahead and preview it, and it looks quite nice, it pops the uh, silhouette out just like that. And that's all there is to it. Thank you for listening. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask me in the comments below. I'd appreciate it if you like and share this video, and subscribe to my channel. Bye!